Oh, hi, and welcome. My name is Daniro, and I uh, welcome you back to Let's Play Octopath Traveler. I have an old man with me. <laughs> I have an old man with me. What? Okay. Um, excuse me. Uh, in the last episode, we completed some quests. We only have what six quests left, and yeah, I rolled a dice in the last part at the end of the last part, and yeah, I rolled a four, which is. We are going by this order, so yeah, Obrick. He's the one who we're gonna play as in this chapter, uh, in this part, and yeah. I originally planned on rolling a dice. Um, let me just save. I don't think I saved, right? I originally planned to roll a dice at the start of this part when we are gonna do chapter four, but yeah, I figured that would not be as good because people can read and for me it would have been a surprise but people who already clicked on this part knew that this would be like all break chapter four so yeah it would take away the surprise so i'm gonna keep the surprise a little bit by rolling a dice every single time after we complete a chapter with one character to determine the next one and yeah this keeps things a little bit random and yeah maybe challenging i don't know and yeah this is how we're gonna do it now and albrick's the first one so let's do his quests first i got this group albrick free tressa scholar hanit apothecary and primrose as a cleric i also changed a little bit of my skills so yeah feel free to I should probably put this out, but yeah, uh, maybe not. If I go, oh yeah, uh, if I go and fight the boss. Um, by the way, I went into the mouth the ice dragon again. Got a purple chest, and it had an adamantine heart, which was really good for Cyrus because it gave a ton of uh, elemental attack so yeah he's even more deadlier now and i got a hypnos crown in the moldering ruins i think someone of you has it yes boom which was also not bad so yeah two more equipments and i say let's go and continue the story with all the record Chapter 4. You make your way to Riverford, where you hope to find the mercenary Werner. Oh yeah, <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> the man behind the fall of Hornburg. And suddenly we are outside of the city again. The story so far. In Wellspring, Aubrey reunited with Erhard. It was there that his erstwhile comrade had sought atonement for his deeds. The two crossed blades, and with that act, the truth was told. Erhard told Obrick about Werner, a former sellsword, and the very man who had orchestrated the fall of Hornburg. I can take this name serious. Such a fiend's too dangerous for this world. I will stop him. I must. Gone are the doves that played Obrick's heart. To protect the people from harm, this is why he wields his blade. As he came to Riverford, the very air was thick with unease and fear. Oi, oh, you! If you want to town, get in the Kui and wait for your turn. Wait your turn for the rest, mm -hmm. like the rest. Kui, I beg your pardon. Oh, yeah. A gentleman, I presume, unless I misjudge your polished bearing. Tell me, sir, what brings you to this town? Jitsu. I'm looking for a man. Hey. I like to get married. Indeed, I think this is your first visit. Uh, so let me give you some free advice. You'll be wanting to press a few leaves into the palms of the guards. There's a tall. Not at all as such. You see, the Lord here. E, when you say about a tall, I never heard uh, not of that of all. Shut your gob. And what's this tincture in your sack? Smuggler, are you? What? That ain't mine. I swear on me, mother's grief. Hmm. Of course it ain't. I suggest you confess your crimes here now. 
Miss you'd rather tell it to the master of the arms. Well, he got inside, so. <laughs> and that good, sir, is why you want some spare coin at the ready. But the law. Those men are the law here. Their rule is absolute. I'm sorry to say. Know that that portion was the guard's own. To fight him at your peril. A pretext to toss you in the gaul is for the ready. In the jail, okay? <laughs> gaul is like jail, right? <laughs> Does no one bring them to task for their deeds? Hmm. Not I, I can tell you that. I do exactly as they tell me, as should you. Punishment is swift and harsh here, both for those who have broken the law and those who have not. A handful of leaves, sir, is my advice. The more you can spare, the better. Oh. I only pray that poor traveler has the wits and means to give the sorter what they seek, else... Parker. And what of the lord of this place? He does nothing to stop this mummery? <laughs> he encourages it. You see, ever since Lord Werner took over here... Oh. Werner? Sugi. Oh, you stop threatening and start moving. Hi. Yes, sir. A thousand pardons. My turn. Perhaps we'll meet again inside. I. Hmm. Very nice, the Lord. By the gods, what happened here? Sugi. Next. Hmm. I'm still thinking. Hmm. And that's Crofty Vagabond. Let's see what rubbish you're toying, toting in that bag. Oh. Will this do? Oh, weapons, oh. money, equipment. Oh, quick on the uptake, this one. Keep it up and you'll do all right in this town, mate. Well, I ask a question, good sir, about this man Werner. Oh. Uh, that's Lord Werner's to the likes of you. Oh. What business could you be having with this lordship? Yeah. No business, friend. Just wondering what kind of man Lord Werner is. Oh. He's bleeding wonderful here. Best thing what ever happened to the town. Oh. Now piss off. We got work to do. Oh. By your leave. There was fear in those eyes. A salesman's captain turned provincial lord. This man has certainly moved up to the world. In the world, my god, I'm so good at meaning again. Traveling banter, it's not every day you hear from mercenary leader becoming a provincial lord. Indeed, he must have been very fortunate or exceedingly clever. Don't be naive, Obrick. In this world, corruption and dirty dealings are the only way a man can rise that fast. Mark my words, his path to fortune is littered with the bodies of men with knives in their backs. And I don't just mean figuratively, either. Yours is our most cynical outlook. Trust me, I speak from experience. I know his type when I see it. You do well to know what you're getting into, if you're picking a fight with him. Fear not. When his words are drawn, a corrupt man is cut down as easy as any other. Hehe, <laughs> then we got nothing to worry about. Why are you giving? Why are you giving me a twice? <laughs> Ulrich is most likely older than you, but I don't know. <laughs> what is this? Oh, I just realized what that is. <laughs> are they burning people there like so witches? Sad. I had never seen a pyre before. Is this for? It's for this lordship's burning. Once someone, some poor zaps get tied to them stakes and burned alive for their sins. Why did I only notice that right now after Obrick was looking at that? <laughs> what is wrong with me? <laughs> did I just walk past that and was like, hmm, this is fine. <laughs> Looks very decorative. Uh, for this month, for last month, and for the month before that, the law of the land it is. Oh, it better not be us for a group. Used to be the outlaws and roads what got burned. But it weren't long before it were drunks and beggars up there for the slightest crimes. 
shouldn't say this out loud, but nowadays all it takes is a cable at his lordship's rule. So a dose the power that oppresses this place. So no one knows who will finger you for what, so we creep out like mice, doing our best not to be noticed. Try to scalp too, and poof, just looking guilty and somewhat hell seal the deal. So Trevor, now you know the kind of place you're fetched up into. Best finish your business and be on your way as soon as you can. Oh, I'm gonna do business here. Now if you'll be excuse me. me. Oh. Well, this is a pretty messed up town. <laughs> uh, I want want to get out of here. I don't feel too good here. You have to take care of this Werner. Mm -hmm. App dark alleyway, yeah. Why not? You, I met you in the square. What a ah, listen, mate, you never seen me, all right? Oi. See there? Yes, sir. Can't have gone far. Sniff him out. Oi. Oh, you seen any doggy, dodgy looking come this way, run for dear life? Dodgy. Hmm. A rebel. A man plotting dark schemes against his lordships himself. So Sounds like a dangerous man. I did see one suspicious fellow running hard in that direction. Conscious. And not in the other one. That must be him. Come on, we're calling that right yet. Oi. A gun. You can breathe easy now. Arigato. God bless you, mate. Mod. Tell me, why were they after you? <laughs> Couldn't rightly say. Mm. They said you were a rebel, that you were plotting against the Lord. Mm. An organized resistance could help me get closer to Werner. Jitsu. Listen, I came to explain search of this Werner. Are there others who fight for your cause? If you have a leader, pray take me to him. Eh? God's teeth, are you deaf? I can't be introducing strangers, but I barely know. So then let me tell you more about me. I know how to swing a blade for one. Reckon as much. You've got that air about you. Yeah. But dang me, this ain't summit I can decide on, on my own. All right, how's this? Proof you know how to use that blade or yours. There's a man back in the square, what wears a red hat. He's with us, the strongest we've got. If you can beat him, then I'll introduce you to the boss. All right. Welcome. No problem. Is that what it takes? No. But you promised me somewhat. All right. You lose, you make yourself scars, and never come back here again. Oh. You have my word. You are. I go on ahead and warn him. You find me when ye when ye are ready. Well, all right. Challenge the man in the red hat. Just challenging random people. Are you the man in the red hat? He's saying to a like a woman that no, is not wearing a hat at all. Something. You don't want that I have to beat up. He's the one. Mm. Yes, wanna see if you can use that sword of his. Hmm. Very well, I'm ready when you are. You will regret those words, son. Hmm. Um, yeah. So, so Elfian Square. Two arms. You look. You look a tough sword, but you're tough enough. You bet I am. Boom. Boom. Oh yeah. I got second serving on him. I 
change some of his things. I think he only had like what was his class again? Warrior or Knight? I don't think it was either of them. I think Warrior, right? So yeah, uh, I think he only had like warrior skills or three out of four, which was, I don't know, not that good, I think. Boom! Ninth. All right. I wanted to give him that one skill that goes beyond 10,000, but then again, I want to equip wow i want to equip this skill once i guaranteely do more damage because sometimes he barely does ten thousand so yeah i yield there's no doubting this one strength jeez get me out of here i did my part now it's your turn i will meet with your leader at once Deals are dear. My name's Reggie, by the way. Come on, I'll take you to the den. What, Reggie? What is what's his name? Reggie Ale Fills something? The president of Nintendo? America, I think. Oh, is he still? I don't know. Reggie Fills Ales or something. I don't know. Uh, his body is ready, by the way. <laughs> Boss, got someone here you might want to eat. Hajimemashite. So I've heard. Welcome, sir. You may call me Harold. Harald. I understand. You are Sir Albrick? <laughs> what? How do you know my name? Hi. One of your deeds in Wellspring reached me some time ago. Captain Bale and I speak quite often, you see. And this oh, battle yeah. was for absolutely nothing. <laughs> He's a good man. But if you'll excuse me, I'll get straight to the point. I must know everything you can tell me about this Lord Verna. <sighs> of course, but perhaps you'll first do me the honor of explaining what business you have with him. I'm gonna murder him in his sleep. A former sales word, Captain. Yes, Verna is certainly that. As the saying goes, I know thine enemy that it suffice to say I have taken a great interest in the man's past. Very prudent of you. Werner claims noble blood, but closer examination reveals that what title he possesses were bought with gold. He accused the former lord of the lands of Lassine and Pillage and won the support of the common folk. Even the buggers were proceeded to make common cause, and soon enough he had them proclaim him the new world. Lord. World. Let's go to a new world. <laughs> But once he took power, that's when the terror began. Terror? Death by fire for criminals, with execution held once per month. The populace initially hailed the new regime. Many were happy to see villains and blackguards get their cover pens. They don't need, but it did not end there. Just so, how many murders can one town have after all? Pickpockets and swindlers were next, then a dishonest merchant. Any peccadillo became a capital offense. In time, mere accusations was enough to land a man on a pyre, even the clearest calumny, and yet... <laughs> by this time, no one dared to raise his voice in opposition. Some had early on, but... When they appeared tied to the stakes at the big next burning, the rest understood that in silence lay the only hope for survival. Mm. But you resist this depot, and so do others like you. Hi. We do. No. I know of us have been forced to look on as family and friends falsely accused were taken by the flames. Jitsua. I am one of them. Werner accused the former lord of corruption, but those accusations were lies. I know for the former lord was my father. 
and so I have taken it upon myself to restore his honor and name, and to free the people of this domain from Werner's tyranny. For each passing day, our ranks grow. At last, uh, at long last, we are poised, ready to strike back. You give me reason to believe we have common cause in this undertaking. Will you join Sir Alberic? So Even if this tyrant were not the man I seek, I'd have reason enough to join you. So My sword is yours. Oh. Fair befall you, sir. Your presence gives us all courage. They are. Now, without further ado, allow me to explain our plot. First, we shall launch a diversionary attack in the square and draw as many of Werner's men as we can. Then our best swordsman shall infiltrate the Lord's Mansion by way of a secret passage known only to me. I wonder who will that be. <laughs> All right. It is a simple enough plan, but such are the best in revolution and war. Prepare as you will, then come to me again when you are ready to fight. Understood, I will do just that. Which is right now. It's not like I have anything else to do, so yeah. They are. Then follow me. My father had this passage constructed as an escape route in the event of a siege. <laughs> Can I please start reading some dialogues? My voice is for some reason hurting a little bit. <laughs> uh, never did I dream would one day use it to break into our home. Our men in the square have begun their faint, but they will not be able to hold out for long once Werner's men arrive. Sir. We must move quickly. Make for the hidden path. Alrighty then, this is this didn't went too long, I think. Travel banter. Orberico. I do not like this. What's troubling you? I had been too easy. Something is not right. I know the plan is sound. I believe that it should succeed. Yet still, something troubles me, and I cannot reason it away. It would do well to listen to your instincts. They often speak the truth. Is there anything you recall that gave rise to your suspicion? No, this is just that. I feel like we are on dear being drawn into a hunter's trap. But a foe is a soldier, a man of a war, and thou knowest his kinds better than I. Soldier or beast, hunter's instinct should never be ignored. I am grateful for the warning. Whatever may be, I shall stand by the side until this quest is complete. And I buy by yours. Let it be so. So he's. So he's probably like. Betraying us, right? That's what's gonna happen. He was like set up by Werner or something. I don't know. Kinda had this in my mind too, but. I don't know. Now I'm pretty much convinced that something is going wrong. Let's go down here. I brought old man with me. Octopath travelers and old man, let's go. <laughs> you know what I'm referencing? Okay. Um, she has that one skill where she restores oh good SP each turn so yeah okay that should be good um fire oh Chick, chick, chick. And the toast flies even got a turn. Ah, 
Aha. Uh, winds. Oh. Ouch. What? <laughs> oh, what? Good. Good. Um, X. Nope. Lands. Okay. Doof. Step, step, step. Okay, Hanit, Level forty-five. Um. Oh yeah. I was thinking, did I have a cleric with me? Ah. And that's a purple chest. Okay. I will most likely not forget that, so I'm not gonna write it down now. Because there's always like a purple chest, except for this one dungeon where I missed one. I think it was probably one, but I missed it. So yeah, that kind of sucked. Mm -mm. I should try and capture some monsters. Mm -hmm. Um, let me give. Let me give you one of those. Hopefully she can capture one of those. Dang it! Really? Yeah, let's, let's just try. Ah. Um. This one. No, I want to. I want to keep Davy Bones. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Yeah. I mean, who knows when they will, when I will be using those. Maybe someday they will be useful. Maybe I have to defeat like a boss without. With only using those things, that would be kind of crazy. <laughs> uh, sword. No, I tried sword. What am I doing? <laughs> um, nope. Uh, X. Nope. Knife. Yes, knife. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, she's in the upper right. I was wondering, since when is Tressa level 40 something something? She's a lot stronger. Can you learn some stuff? Except her. She has over 9,000 job points. Which I will use once we get... The other jobs that we came across well not really came across but we soon will gather and i could probably do all of this in this part like maybe i'll do that the ways of maneuver just helps to but then again, I don't know how strong and how long it will take to defeat the boss. So yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, maybe the boss takes like half an hour. 
So yeah. But just keep it that way. Like one part introduction to the next chapter and the next part boss of the new chapter. Right? Uh, uh, that was probably not the best thing I could do in this. Well, whatever. Ah, uh, whatever. I wanted to capture those guys, but uh, whatever. Um, do I try fire on those rats? Probably. Or maybe if I'm lucky. Ah, oh, dang it. Come on. I want to try if I can capture this thing. There needs to be like something that can raise my chance to capture those things, but kind of like um, what was it in Final Fantasy VI, a Hypno Crown, which is ironic because I found an item that is called like that in the last part. So yeah. I think Hypno Crown in Final Fantasy VI raised the chance to to uh what was it manipulate enemies right no that was not Final Fantasy VI that was Final Fantasy VII I don't know in one Final Fantasy game there was a Hypno Crown that raised the chance of something so yeah. There you go. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, just... Why are those guys weak against? I don't know. What did I not try? Boom. Knife? No. Staves? No. I just want. I just want to know. I mean. <laughs> Kind of stupid because I don't know, it doesn't really help me. Okay, I wonder if that helps. Like, does that help? I don't think so, but maybe. Wolf. Okay, now. Fifty percent, really? Ah. That's like the highest I could get. 50 percent i mean come on i think it has something to do with the level right okay i'm kind of confused because there's a green thingy that means there's some kind of event coming up right and then on the map there's something else on the left and m master is still playing splatoon 2. well tomorrow is a 
what uh holiday so yeah it's eastern eastern monday i don't know how you call that in english but it roughly translates to rose monday and it's a day where you don't have to work <laughs> the next day and i got free tomorrow too so yeah i can record a good bunch so yeah um i want to look let me just get that it's probably a cutscene popping up right let me just get that unless there's the boss coming up right now that would kind of be bad oh hi only a short ways to go now i thank you again for your aid my friends today Werner's reign of terror comes to an end yay reign of terror do you call it strong and able rule say we look out no not the old man what the out of my way demons take them but these two will not fall easily he's dangerous that one deal with him all logic yes lord banner as easy to read as that lily livered father of yours what oh oh he means hard okay as we speak my man is crushing what remains of your diversionary face fast in the town square Werner, but how did you your guards you really are your father's son aren't you <laughs> It was immediately obvious to the right in the square was merely a distraction. All that hop up to such little aim. It hardly required a scholar's deduction to determine where the main strike was to fall. <laughs> what a feeble, flaccid scheme. Better you had burned down the entire city. Did concern of uh, for your fellow citizens hold your back? I thought you had the latitude for such charity. <laughs> You need an answer. You can ponder your uh, folly while you await your fate in our gulls. I was worried we might run out of scoundrels for the pious. Now, thanks to you, we have plenty for months to come. The people will be most gratefully for the respite. I don't doubt. Rot in hell, you meadows brute! Fire! Ah. Sparrows. <laughs> okay. Oh, jeez. I need shoot them. Use arrow storm. <laughs> I find it so funny that. That Obrick is always like in his mind, like <laughs> sometimes he just crosses his arms and thinks well things are happening around here. I think this is so funny. <laughs> and it's happening again. Oh I got flashbacks from the war. I think it's already too late for that. Oh. Oh, I freaking I freaking knew that he was jumping to save us. You get it because your country doesn't exist anymore. で、今度こそ。俺は守ると決めたのだ。ああ、その通りだ。今度こそ。守ろう。ああ、ステッ。ああ、ヘロ。なるほど。お前なぜ。ウェルスプリングの一件が片付いたのでな。お前を追ってき
Let's go. しかし今や私たちの剣は一つ。友のため、守るもののため、双璧の騎士がお相手しよう。エラスカナエピック。そうだろう、オルベリク。ああ、そうだ。それこそが俺の。Let's go. Destroy them all. <laughs> what? <laughs> what was that? Okay. <laughs> that's more like it. He died. <laughs> what are you talking about? Hmm, <laughs> that's more like it. He he got destroyed. <laughs> Alright, and there's a safe point, that's what I was looking for. But before that, traveling banter. Yahoo, Erd, save the day. Only in the nick of time, it took far too long to reach us. I thought we were all done for. I'm so glad he showed up when he did. This is us, this is us if he deliberately left it to the last possible moment. <laughs> you know, you don't have to be so serious all the time. But I am not happy either. Are you sure about that? Because I'm pretty sure I saw you smiling back there. You can't fool me, Sir Obrick. Hmm, let's go. Ha, huh, men are so funny when they try to hide their feelings. Shut up. <laughs> you girl, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, I think that's it for this part. In the next episode, we're gonna go and continue. Maybe is there a save point right above me? What? Okay. Anyway, um, I thank you all for watching. Please consider leaving a like, a comment, or subscribe, and then we're gonna go and continue this chapter in the next part. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.